OHC parents, I hope that you are doing well. I want you to know that you are being prayed for every single day. And if there is something that we can specifically be praying about for you, feel free to put that request in the comments and we would be honored to pray over those specific requests with you. You know, you're probably, or maybe you have dealt with some worry or some, some anxiety over this time in quarantine. I know I have dealt with my fair share. Well, I wanna take us back to a Psalm. If you're in the Psalm reading challenge with us, we've already read this, but I wanna take us back to Psalm chapter 55 and verse 22, and chances are, even if you're not in the Psalm reading challenge, you have heard this verse before. It says, cast your cares on the Lord and he will sustain you. He will never let the righteous fall. And when I read over that, I just thought, okay, God, I need to get this down. I need to understand what does it actually mean to cast my cares on him? And I don't know about you, but I, um, God teaches me a lot through my children. And he taught me this lesson of what it actually means just the other day on our way to Whataburger. My boys were in the back seat, and it turns out one of my boys got really worried that I was going to hit some deer that were way off in the distance. And it just I just didn't understand why he was so worried, because like I said, they were so far away. But then the other thing was, is I was like, why, why are you worried about that? You shouldn't even have to be worrying about that. You're in the back seat and you're messing around with your brother. Like, I, you don't need to be worrying about that. And so I told him, I said, Rock, you just need to trust me. I'm, I'm not gonna let you get hurt. And that's when it hit me. My heart for my son to cast that worry on me and just trust me that I am going to protect him is the same heart that I believe God has in this scripture. He wants us to cast his care, our care on him, not, not to worry and not to, not to be full of anxiety, but to cast our care on him. Now, I'm not sure what all that says about my driving, but <laughs> the fact that he was so worried I would hit some deer so far away. But the next time your kids worry or um, they just are filled with some anxiety and you wanna just take that from them, that you know that, that there are things that they don't need to be worried about. Remember our heart, um, God's heart for us is the same way. And I hope that this encourages you. I hope this helps you cast your cares on him a little more. Um, and like I said, we are praying for you and uh, we're looking forward to when we can meet again. Have a great day.